Love. Today we are going to make fairy gardens. We're going to start, you can start with any old container, a pie pan or an old container from fast food place, but you can start any one you want. And you're going to fill it with dirt. Any old dirt will be fine. If you've got dirt in the backyard, you can use the dirt in the backyard. That's fine too. We're not going to fill it all the way up. We're only going to do about two thirds of the way. I'll make two different ones so you can see. And just kind of smooth it out. See? Then we're going to take our biggest things that we're going to put in our fairy garden. I have two different things. We can do a door, or we can actually do a little house. I'm going to stick the little house in this one. Actually, it's a ice cream shop. To put the little door in this one. You kind of shove it into your dirt. You want your biggest things first and then you can put, after you put your big things down, then you can put your little stuff down. I have some pine cones. I think I'll put my pine cones here with this one. And I have a little swing for my gnome or my fairy to sit in. I'm going to set it over here. Probably use a little more dirt in that one. Now also, if you want to plant flowers or any kind of um, herbs or something in your garden, you take a little cup like this and you fill that one with dirt and put your seeds in it. That way you have more control of where your seeds are at and where your water is going when you water it. So we're going to put this over here on this one. And then we got our seeds. We'll put our seeds in there. I have marigolds, so we'll just put them in there, tuck them down in there. I just put the hole because these are old seeds, so. And that way when you water it, everything will get wet. They'll just get the seeds wet. What else do I have big here? You can use old corkscrews, uh, corks from your bottles. Mom and dads have bottles, they have corks. <laughs> or you could use twigs about this size or smaller, and you can set them somewhere, anywhere you want. Uh, let's put some over here. Now, the deeper you put them, they can be stools or they can just be anything you want it to be. This one's going to be our gnome house. I'm going to put our gnome here, but he needs a sidewalk to walk up to his. So, with their, to make a sidewalk, you can use old caps or you can use stones, flat stones or round stones or any kind of something. Bark, tree bark would work. And we're going to set them in front of his house, and then we'll stick one over here towards his. And I think I'm going to put him right there on his doorway. And there you have a small fairy garden. Now this one, I have a few other pieces with this. Since this is a candy shop, oops, I have a little sign that says welcome. So I'm going to put that up there. We need to pull out our path. And I thought marbles would be cute to make a path to line our path. So I just stick those marbles down in there. To make it line your path. I guess my sign doesn't want to stay up very well. Now if you have um, little glass beads at home, you can use little glass beads. You can use gravel. And there's our little path to our ice cream shop. And then when we water, we'll have flowers coming out of it. And I have a little fairy who's reading the book. So she's going to sit here while waiting for you guys to come to her ice cream place and read her book. And here we have a little turtle. We'll have him walking up our path to our ice cream shop. And that's what you can do for a fairy garden. Now some other things to add to your fairy garden, you can use little plastic toys. Doesn't matter, any small. And then they found a big marble and a cap to like a toothpaste. You know how people have those um, glow bulbs in their in their gardens, in the yard? You can stick a big marble on top of it and it'll look like one of those glow balls that you have in your yard. It will stick him in the, in our gnomes one. So there you have it, two types of fairy gardens. You just go wild with whatever you want have at home. Use recyclables if you have them. And have a great day.